Edinburgh Information Kilo. Time 1350 Zulu. Runway in use 24, transition level flight level 70, surface winds 260 degrees 12 knots, visibility 10 kilometers, or more. Scattered 3400 feet, temperature plus 10, dew point plus 2, QNH 1020. QNH 1020. Edinburgh ground, good afternoon, Chanix 612737800. Stand to five with Kilo one zero two zero. Request by far to Madeira, please. Edinburgh Grand Citation India three Romeo Foxtrot. Very good afternoon. Uh, I for clearance to Vagar, please. Uh, stand one or two, and we have Kilo. India three Romeo Foxtrot. Edinburgh Grand. Good afternoon. Say again your stand number. Uh, one o two. India 3, Romeo Foxtrot, thank you. Information, Kilos, current cleared Vaga, Grice 3, Charlie departure, Squawk 2702, and the QNH 1019. Right, India 3, Romeo Foxtrot, cleared 2, Vaga, Vaga, Grice 3, Charlie departure, uh, Squawk 2702, and the QNH is 1019. India 3, Romeo Foxtrot, correct. Here's the weather for our flight. Edinburgh, a li little bit shit. No rain here on the ground, but uh, quite nasty here in Scotland. And a presumably dry landing in Vagar. A good look at the satellite image, which looks atrocious. Therefore, visibility not very good. The prevailing winds from the west. Edinburgh Ground, uh, India 3, Romeo Foxtrot, stand 1 or 2, ready for push and start. India 3, Romeo Foxtrot, stand 1, say ready to push and start approved. Push and start approved, India 3, Romeo Fox. Okay, so here we are, after engine checklist complete. Uh, Alright, so we're here on the main apron. I'm gonna ask for taxi clearance, most likely gonna get Echo, probably Alpha 13, and then all the way up to Delta. Let's see. Edinburgh Grand India 3, Romeo Foxtrot, ready to taxi. India 3, Romeo, Foxtrot, taxi via Echo 1, Alpha. Uh, are you able, Charlie 1, for the intersection? Able. India 3, Romeo, Foxtrot, Roger. Taxi Echo 1, Alpha, hold Charlie 1. Taxi via Echo 1, Alpha, Charlie 1, India 3, Romeo, Foxtrot. Cool, 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 cool. D17, Tango, stand 2-0, ready for push start. We'll do our D17, Tango, stand 2-1, push and start to proof. Taxi lights are on. Start face west, uh, easy one seven tank Brakes are working. Parker brake is working, brakes, nose wheel steering, blah blah blah. Flight instruments are checked. I said two nine echo ready attack. I said two nine echo hold at Fox Shot One. Flaps two two. I said two nine echo hold at Fox Shot One. Trims are set, crew briefing is done, TCAS is enabled. I said 29 Echo, hold and point Fox Show 1. I said 29 Echo, Roger, give way to citation CJ4 taxiing left to right on Alpha, then taxi via Alpha to hold Delta 1. Taxi via Alpha to Delta 1, give way to citation. Give way to uh, me. I said Thank you. Cool, 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 thank you. And we can do Charlie 1, that's Charlie 3, Charlie 1, yes. Is that Charlie 1? Yes, it is. India 3, Romeo Foxtrot, contact Edinburgh Tower, 118 decimal 7, bye bye. 1187 to Tower, India 3, Romeo Foxtrot, to see ya. Good ice protection system not required. Pitch static heat is on. 
Exterior lights are on. Because it's set. Good. Edinburgh Tower, uh, India 3, Romeo Fox Road, Charlie 1. Alright, we've got one departure ahead of us here for sure. There's a second one over there. Right, we're gonna be number three, I guess. Maybe number four. Fox Road, Papa Yankee, 4 4 Alpha, Edinburgh Tower. Alpha Alpha, go ahead. Line up on my uh, 2 4. Line up on my 2 4, Alpha Alpha. Alpha. Very nice. Alright, so we're in the queue here, runway 24, which is identified. India 3, Romeo Fox at the top. Go ahead for India 3, Romeo Fox at the top. Uh, can I ask him you've been given full clearance for your flight? Uh, not sure I understood you correctly, we have been given the clearance. India 3, Romeo Fox at India 3, Romeo Fox at line up runway 24. Lining up runway 24, India 3, runway Fox Road. Shall we eat out and the car? Letting us out before this guy. Very nice. And Brett Tower, this is I said, 29 Echo Holden Point Delta 1. Easy 486 at Delta. Contact uh, radar on 121.2. 121.2, thank you. Thank you. Delta 1111. India 3, uh, Romeo Foxtrot, runway 24, clear takeoff, service with 0 degrees of 1, 4 knots. Uh, runway 24, clear takeoff, India 3, Romeo Foxtrot, thanks. Brakes, takeoff power set and achieve, two good engines. Back, uh, Foxtrot, clear to leave orbit and report final runway 24. Report final runway 24, go. Uh, Airspeed is alive. Request the full stop. Full stop, roger. V1, rotate. Positive key, climb gear up. V2 plus 20 flaps up and climb detent. There we go, that's already it. Cross pop a box for the takeoff type. It's a. Um um, uh, I can't remember, DR-400 DR-400, roger Send the bit how good afternoon, EV-17 Tango at Delta 3 EV-17 Tango, roger, uh, hold position Holding position, EV-17 Tango, hold position India 3, Romeo Fox, start uh, no further ATC, Monty Unicorn 122 decimal 8, good flight, goodbye. Shame, in, uh, Unicorn 122 decimal 8, have a good evening, India 3, Romeo Fox, start. Fox, start, Alpha, Yankee 44, Alpha, Romeo 24, clear takeoff, surface wind. Too bad, did approach just disappear. It's a shame. Okay, well, we're going to. Do our departure here. Still hand flying. Yo damper is on. Well, we got a good view of the Edinburgh Bay. Uh, three nice bridges down here. Airport, busy, busy. Altitude. Clear ourselves up to cruise and give ourselves a shortcut. We need to fly all this stuff here. It's one of the 
tightest departures I've ever flown. Crazy tight. So we're going to give ourselves a shortcut to Grace. Okay, time to set up the autopilot up to 14,000. There it is. We are on heading, so. Armed, flight level change, and autopilot. Atrocious weather. Switch to standard pressures at this point. Landing lights are off, taxi lights are off, and let's turn off the seatbelt. Right, that was pretty smooth. half hour until we reach our destination this is where we are just about 15 minutes off the coast of Scotland we have a few approaches as our nav approaches in ILS we're gonna select the ILS Yankee which starts here at Sudur there's a holding as well at 4,000 feet Let's configure this in the FMS, so in the departures we can select ILS 3.0, Victor Golf is here, so we're selecting the VG transition, that's done. Since we're here we select performance, so we set 2.9.0 at 2.9, we're taking the higher wind value here, 8 degrees. 1002 on the QNH and that yields a VRF of 110 and 117 which we're gonna post over here that's done 
so as we said, we're coming in here at Sudo with just the initial approach fix. And then at 4,000 feet, intercept the ILS at a heading of 304, 305. Let's have a look at the missed approach procedure. Climb to 4,000 feet by the RNAV. Missed approach to Mani, which is here. Enter holding here or get resequenced for the ILS. Have a standard glide slope, more or less three and a half degrees. I'm gonna come in at hmm, maybe 140, 160, so a thousand feet per minute, maybe a bit less. Uh, this intercept at 10 miles and our decision altitude for our class is 475 feet per minute okay, so the mist approach seems to hover around 475 to 4 to 515 depending on what our mist approach climb gradient is meaning how how quickly can we climb again in case this goes wrong we'll plug in 500 for our decision altitude and we have to go mist at roughly three miles from the threshold we got a good two miles here to decide whether we see the airport otherwise we will have to abort and run the mist approach procedure all right uh, it's quite a while to go so i'll talk to you once we are in the clouds i guess see you then We're going to uh, slightly change our route here. We want to go to a direct intercept of the ILS. So we're going to go direct this waypoint here. Approach checklist landing data is confirmed. Crew briefing has been performed. The avionics and instruments are checked. Minimums are set. Fuel transfer selector is both. A uh, quick look at our fuel, a thousand kilos on both sides, so fuel is fine. External lights uh, switched on and uh, as protection systems are coming on as well. Seats upright, belts, passenger life safety button coming up. Uh, pressurization is dropping, that's good. Alright, those are the items remaining for the approach checklist. Ah, would you look at that? Beautiful. Ah, we got one of the first islands in sight at this point. And we're off the path now, which is not great, so speed brakes are coming out. Gonna descend a bit steeper at this point, so switch to VS mode. And drop this thing. Try to catch up with the vertical path here. Can see the guy, but there's a dude roughly here, I think. Ah, there he is. This guy's descending. Logger traffic, citation, uh, ILS Yankee for runway 30, about five minutes from the uh, final approach fix. I should be straight ahead. There. Ok. 
Okay. Guys right ahead of us. Okay, well, traffic. Uh, we got you in sight on the ILS. Uh, will be number two. Really hard to hear. It's nice, nice example of how you organize yourself on Unicom. So. We are going to drop Altitude. the flaps at this point to slow down a bit more. Speed was checked. Gonna have to slow down quite a bit because uh, you have to backtrack at this airport. So he needs a little time to get out of the way. So we're gonna go to our approach speed, put the gear down. Which means also our checklist flaps to approach and. Uh, what was that? Passenger light safety, but there you go. Unreadable. I'm going to keep it at 120 knots approach speed here as we head into the soup. Ah, that's gorgeous. Four degrees outside temperature. Whoa. I can see how you can get spatial disorientation. It looked like I was just falling through these clouds. Even though I'm not. Right, gear is down. Three greens flaps at approach. Landing gear and flaps. Speed brakes are zero. Yes, very good. Getting a bit fast. Speed is checked. Autopilot and yaw damper is going to come off. Let's fly this ILS manually. Haven't done that for a while. Holy crap, scary shit. Okay, we are on the glide slope, adding a little power. And we can see the runway lights. And we're still at 1200 feet, so no issues with our minimums. 
to do speed to below 140 here and then drop the flaps. Okay. Roger. Uh, we are on a short final runway 30 Vagar traffic. Okay, flaps full. A bit low. Wind from pretty much straight ahead. Too low, too low, too low. Oh, horrific. Okay, idle. Altitude. Spoilers deployed. Some manual braking flaps are up. Okay, that was almost a go around condition. Cargo traffic, citation, runway 30 vacated. Where are we heading? Over here. Okay, scary approach. All these cliffs on final are making this uh, very, very interesting. Nice, so <clears throat> we're going to be here for a quick refueling and then continue on to Iceland. In the meantime, take a bit of a coffee break. Right, so that does it for our first leg of the Atlantic crossing. I'm going to depart here shortly and head over to Iceland. In the meantime, that's it. Hope you liked being on the right seat and see you shortly. <laughs>